You said it's not a pleasant sight to see Ozzy fire someone. Did you see him fire someone else besides George Lynch? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I, well, I think the worst one was when he fired Don Costa, who was the bass player when I joined the band. Um, and he was he was only in it for maybe three months or something. Okay. It was um, we did a European tour opening for White Snake, and then we did some uh, American uh, gigs, makeup gigs from that were canceled because of you know Randy's passing. Uh, yeah. We did that, and then and then one day Don, who who was playing bass, uh, got called to the back of the bus uh, by Ozzy. And maybe three minutes later, Don c came running out of the back, holding his face, and there was blood all over his face. <laughs> and 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 he ran off the bus. I I was like, holy shit! And I walked back and I saw Ozzy, and he just looked at me and and I said, what happened? And he said, he tried to kiss me. <laughs> he said, wait a minute, <laughs> you're telling me the bass player just went to the back of the bus and tried to kiss you and said, yeah, that's my story. So I went out and I, I asked Don what happened. And he said, I don't know. I just went back there. Ozzy said he had something to say. And he said, he said, come closer, come closer. And as soon as I got close enough, he headbutted me in the nose. And I was like, well, shit. I was like, oh, shit, dude. I think you just got fired. And... and and then after, uh, you know, the ensuing weeks after that, the very next gig was going to be the Us Festival. Okay. And I think that was um, maybe three weeks away. Because, you know, basically Ozzy assaulted him. Um, he, uh, uh, I talked to Don, and he said they worked it all out. He signed, a, he signed an agreement that he would never press charges or anything. And then they spent, um, I think, five grand to have his nose fixed uh through plastic surgery i said okay but i i are you're not in the band anymore and he said no i'm still in the band i said really so you're gonna play the us festival i said yeah they told me to show up uh on a certain day certain time so we did to go out to the us festival i was there and i saw bob daisley there and i was like oh What's, and I, I walked up to him and I said, hi, uh, my name's Jake, you're Bob Daisley, yeah. uh, what's going on? <laughs> and he said, oh, I'm playing bass for you now. <laughs> I said, you are? I said, well, I don't think the other guy knows that. <laughs> and, and so then I saw Don pulling up and I, I ran out to him and I said, hey, what are you doing? And he said, I showed up for the gig. And he said, I brought my family with me. Oh. They're all coming They're all coming to see me play. I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> and I wasn't going to tell him. So I said, okay. And I walked away. And I saw him. He's all happy. He's all smiling. He's got his family with him. And I saw him walk up to the bus. I saw Sharon come up and <laughs> tell him that he wasn't in the band anymore. And I... I, it was, I could just, it was horrible. It was terrible. I, I mean, if you're going to fire somebody, why do it like that? So yeah. Yeah. that, that, I think that was the worst firing I saw. Um, and I don't know how, how it could get much worse, but yeah. So when I got fired, I, I think I actually got a, a pretty good deal. <laughs> Is it true that 